Hello everyone, welcome back to AI Geeked. In today's video, we're going to explore an amazing all-in-one tool called MetaGPT, a powerful platform where you can build websites, blogs, documents, slides, apps, and so much more with just a simple prompt. Once you click the link in the description and create your free account, you'll land on a clean and simple dashboard that looks like this. At the top, you'll see a prompt bar. This is where the magic happens. Just type what you want to build, whether it's a website, web app, blog post, document, or anything else, and MGX will generate it for you automatically. Below that, you'll find a variety of ready-made templates you can explore and use. These include website templates, game templates, productivity templates, prototypes, data analysis tools, business card templates, blogs, and many others. You can choose any template you like, open it to view full details, and even customize it completely to match your needs. When you click the three-dot menu on any template, you get more options like Remix to make your own version, Open in Chat, and Copy Link to share it with others. Now, let's walk through the process of creating something from scratch. And if needed, I can also upload files or folders for context. I can select a team type, like Team or Engineer, then, I choose the AI model I want to use. Options include Claude Sonnet, GPT-4, and more. So, I'll type my prompt in the prompt bar just like this. Create a modern AI editing system web app with a clean and minimal interface. Once everything is set, I hit the search button and MGX will begin generating the app. This might take a few moments, so just wait while it processes. And now, as you can see, the web app has been fully generated. We now have a beautifully designed AI editor with features like profile icon, history, save and output settings, and multiple pages like home, grammar check, rewrite, content generator, and more. You can simply paste your text into the editor and let the AI rewrite or improve it instantly. Want to preview how your web app looks on different devices? MGX lets you toggle between mobile view and desktop view with a single click. And when you're ready to share your app with the world, just hit the publish button. You'll get a unique URL that you can copy and share with anyone. So that's how easy it is to build your own website, blog, app, or tool using MGX. No coding skills needed, just type your idea and let AI handle the rest. Now, besides websites and web apps, it also allows you to effortlessly generate slides, documents, blog posts, and much more. Let me show you how to generate a blog post. I'll go ahead and type my prompt, create a modern, elegant, and feminine blog website for a proposal brand. Once I paste the prompt into the prompt bar, I just click the generate button. And now, it begins the process you'll see it starting to generate the blog structure and content in real time. The assistant, named Alex, is now working on your blog idea, analyzing your prompt, and turning it into actual code and design. This part may take a few seconds, so just wait while it processes everything. And that's it. Our blog website is ready. You can now fully view and explore the generated blog. Just look at how clean and elegant the design is, exactly what we asked for. If you want, you can preview it in full mode to see how it will look live. The blog includes useful sections like home, about, blog content, and more tabs, all professionally structured and customizable. As you can see, it makes it incredibly easy to generate professional websites, apps, blog posts, slides, and documents, all with just a few clicks and a simple prompt. The best part? no coding required. So, if you're a blogger, developer, entrepreneur, or content creator, it is a game changer. You'll find the link in the video description below. That's all for today's video. If you found this tutorial helpful, make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you never miss out on future updates. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.